well, we just got four inches dumped on us. What do you do when uh, there's no work and um, all this fresh snow? You go cross-country skiing. Check this out. Here we go, guys. Welcome to Hidden Valley Homestead, where my wife Olivia and I escaped the city to homestead our off-grid property in Idaho. This is our journey. four inches of fresh snow. It's about 10 degrees outside, maybe eight. Fluffy white powder. Perfect for skiing. You warm, honey? You look warm. My little snow bunny. <laughs> I found these at a thrift store. These are high countries. Kazamas. And these are some Oh, who makes this some swallows? Yeah, so we got some pretty good deals on these things. I don't know, five bucks a set or something. So uh, we're gonna try these things on. You guys tell me, did I mess up and get downhill cross countries? I know these Scarpa boots are like $400 a set. Okay, excuse me, Barrett, I'm trying to film. Up? Are these not the ones? I don't know. I just thought that these, they're, they're definitely cross country because they have the toe on them. My lovely bride here has never cross country skied. I grew up cross country skiing, but we always had the shoes. But I found these boots that are in perfect shape, practically brand new, Scarpas. Um, yeah. So uh, hopefully these aren't just downhill cross country boots. Hopefully they'll work. They'll probably work just fine. I figured I fig the, the boot would be better than a shoe so you don't get you don't have to worry about gaiters as much and you can uh, you don't get snow in your shoes. So uh, we'll check it out. 30 minutes later Scott is still trying to put his boot on. I've never had these on before. Okay, pull it out for a second. Okay, so these three little knobs right here line up with three little holes on the bottom right here. Which are right there. Okay, go ahead and stick it down. Made in Norway. There we go. All right, got it. Okay, so you're just gonna slide, you're gliding. So as you kick the ski forward and you push off the back one, see how my, my heel comes off the ground? You can bring your skis off, yeah. No, you can bring your skis up, but sliding. Lunge forward. <laughs> You're doing good, woman. Not bad for your first time. Thank, thank you for making tracks for me. Whoa. Oh, I hope I don't fall. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, oh, crap. I'm good. Get back, Barrett. What is wrong with you? I know he wants to play. Man, we didn't need to wax these skis. There's still lots of nice powder, though. Right? Good job, honey. You're doing so good. Fantastic. I thought for sure she was gonna fall over by now, catch an edge, but she has really good balance. Doing good. Of course, the dogs love it. Dogs love them being out here no matter what. Thrift store skiing. All 
All right, guys, thanks for watching. You guys leave me a comment in the bottom. T tell me, what did I get? Did I get these cross trekking boots? Were these mountain cross country ski boots? What did I get? They're awesome. They're comfortable. They are warm and they're gonna keep the snow out of our socks. So we're gonna enjoy this, uh, this snow day off together and um, get after it. See you guys in the next video. Oh man, now I gotta catch up to my bride. She's outdoing me. I'm trying to keep up with her.